This video introduces a new application using the Dart QDA system with LiveID for analysis of beer samples. Screening beer using the Dart method requires no sample preparation, allowing simpler and faster analysis time. To manually test one beer sample, you can simply dip a fiber into the beer and then place it in front of the Dart ionization beam. Another method is to pour some beer into a reservoir and dip a multi-pin apparatus into the beer. This multi-pin apparatus allows for higher throughput analysis of beer replicates, as it can be placed onto an automated linear rail and run all 24 beer-coated pin samples through the Dart ionization stream for analysis in under 3 minutes. These sample files can then be used to create models in the LiveID statistical processing software. For separate analysis of individual beer samples, a 384 well microtiter plate can be pipetted into and then sampled directly with these pins. We can use these statistical models for fast characterization of different beer varieties. For example, the model shown here reveals clear differences between four different types of beers tested. This should allow for easy distinction between different types of beer when screening. Another capability of these models is to help determine differences in quality and features of a certain brand of beer, based on factors like storage condition and age. Here, separate cans of beer were kept cold and warm and then tested with the Dart QDA system each week to determine if any differences were present. There are differences seen in the beer when left to age in the cold or the warm, and you can see changes over time. In some cases, the spectral fingerprints are visibly different. LiveID can identify those differences and the ones that aren't visible to the naked eye. As seen here using the LiveID statistical models, we can easily discriminate between the beer samples stored in the various conditions for different periods of time. This Dart QDA with LiveID system not only allows for beer analysis, but it is also a useful method for characterization and quality checks for many other food and beverage applications as well.